Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing exponential functions. Exponential functions are functions where we have to the power of x. For example, f of x equals one third times six to the power of x at x equals two. We're trying to evaluate this. So first we're gonna plug x for two. If we haven't seen our functions video, go back to that. So it's going to be one third times six to the power of x at x equals two. So it's going to be one third times six to the power of two is 36. One third times 36 is simply 36 divided by three. So it's going to be 12. So that's what you get if you evaluate these function at the given value. Let's do another example or a few more. Let's say we have f of n equals 10 times 2 to the power of n at n equals 3. I encourage you to pause the video and try to evaluate this function. All right, I'm going to do it now. So we're going to have 10 times 2 to the power of 3, which will simplify to 10 times 8 which is 80. That is how you evaluate these function. All right, let's do another example. All right, let's say we have f of n equals 100 times two to the power of n at n equals one. First, we're going to evaluate that. So, a hundred times two to the power of one. Two to the power of one is simply two, and a hundred times two is two hundred. And that's what you get when you evaluate these function. Let's give you a few more examples. Let's say we have f of y equals 3 times 10 to the power of y plus 1 at y equals 2. Try this one. Let's plug y for two. So it's gonna be three times 10 squared plus one. Now we have order of operations. We're going to do PEMDAS on multiplication. So exponents is first, sorry. So we're going to have three times 10 squared is 100 plus one. Now we're going to multiplication before addition. So we're going to have 300 plus 1, which is equal to 301. That is what we get if you evaluate this function. Let's do one more example, and then we will end the video. Let me give you a tricky one or a more complex one. Let's say we have... f of y equals 2 times 2y to the power of y plus 2 at y equals 
two. What do you do for this one? We have two y, two times y to the power of y. We're gonna plug y for two. So we're gonna have two times, two times y to the power of y. See, we have two times. So y is two. So two to the power of two, which is four. So we're gonna have times that four plus two. Two times two is four. Four times two is 16. And 16 plus two is 18. That is what we get if you evaluate this function. Thanks for watching, evaluating if exponential functions. If you have any comments, post them. If you have any questions, post them in the comments. All right, thank you, bye.